Cecilia the Amateur and this is my channel. Welcome. And I don't know what title I'm going to pick yet, but I will be doing an unboxing of a toy today from Creatable World. And I haven't done an unboxing of any Creatable World before either. So, it's going to be new for the both of us. And if you hear any noises, they're birds. The birds are really heavy footed here. I don't know why. Um, I almost feel like the roof is going to fall on me. But anyways, let's do this. Already messing up because I don't know how to open this. So... If you don't like watching this content, don't worry. I'm going to have several different videos. I already have my home series. I also did a story of how I injured my foot. And since I'm Cecilia the Amateur, don't expect the best. But don't judge me. Okay, so I'm opening it. And I see a bunch of stuff in here. So the first thing I see... Is this thing right here? I'm guessing these are all the characters that I can make. So, Creatable World is, I guess, a doll that you can create a hundred different ways. That's what it says here. And you have different styles. And every time you play, you can make a different character if I haven't said that already. So, that's a cute poster. And then, let's see. This is the actual doll. You can have her hair long or keep it short. And then it comes with all the ex oh, like this. All the accessories right here. See? Okay. Let's do this. Let's let's open her up. It's very easy packaging, look. Like that. And for those of you who don't know me, I love dolls. Um, I used to have a lot growing up um, from hand-me-downs or from thrift stores or the swap me. Um, I used to get a lot of my accessories from there. Also from Mexico. Shout out to my homies in Mexico with the Tianguis back in the day. They had a huge selection of Barbies. Not as awesome as they don't have that now. At least not as awesome as I had it when I was a child. So, with that said, it won't be the last time. That won't be the last time that you guys see me doing a video when it comes to Barbies, because I plan to show you my entire collection of dolls. And I'm not the person to keep them in their box. That's not fun. So that's one of the reasons why I want to do more unboxings, so I can get them out of their box. I hate when people collect. I mean, no. Let me rephrase that. To each their own for the people who collect. But I just don't find it fun to keep them in their box. And if I ever have a kid, I plan to play with them. So, let me just take everything out. And then I'll show you guys what I'm taking out. Because it's a lot of stuff, let me tell you. And these are so cute. Okay. But yes, I have frat dolls, I have Monster High dolls, I have Barbie dolls from back, from back like 2000, and I have, what else do I have? I have some, I have a princess doll, two princess dolls, one of them is very old and like, you know, needs a lot of work. But yes, let's start off with the shoes. It comes with three pairs of shoes. The first ones are these cuties right here. Focus. They're like little like combat boots in silver. I kind of wish they were black, but that's just my preference. Yes. Going back to also people who collect dolls. I do love all their accounts though. I I follow several of them on Instagram and on TikTok and I do like I do enjoy watching their collection. But anyways, these are a cute pair of flats. They're blue. So cute. And some sneakers. 
So these are pink sneakers. I feel like these should almost be checkered. I probably, should I do that? Should I be? I probably do that. I never done it, but it doesn't hurt to, to try. Dye these like sneakers. By the way, I do have another creatable doll, so that'll be in another video. So yes, she has like combat boots that I'm guessing they're like casual, like what is it like? Casual, formal? No, no, that's not right. What's well, like when you don't want to dress down, but you don't want to dress up either? I feel like you will wear these. And then the sneakers are more like when you want to be like casual. And then this is a little bit more like formal wear. Okay, so then moving on to the clothes. Well, let's show you the wig first. Sorry, I'm all over the place. This is a cute wig. It needs to be brushed out. Because in the picture, let me see if I have it. It looks a lot more fluffier. See? So, I want it to look like that. So, I'm going to have to work with what I have for now. But, I'm going to have to figure out how I'm going to fluff it up. Because I want that. that. That's the reason why, one of the reasons why I got this doll is because I love the hair. Like, I wish this was my hair. Okay. I only have it wavy. I did do a braid for this look, but naturally my hair is wavy. Same with the doll. It's, I guess from being in the packaging, obviously, like, it got really flat, but I would love it to be curlier. So this is a doll. It comes with black underneath clothes, which is cute. It's like PJs. And then, what else, what else, what else besides the hair? There's some cute glasses. These are really cute. And then there's a beanie, which I love. I don't know how it's going to fit on the hair. I'm not judging you. Cute little beanie. And then for pants, she has, or he, but my character will be a she because of the hair. I love it, and I wish that was me. These cute little leggings. I oh, Look at the detailing right here. There's ruching on the side. That's cute. That's really cute. And they, this is a really nice color. I love this color. The texture is nice. That's really cute. And then there's a cute little bag. Look at this cute little bag. I love it. Look at this. Okay, what else do we have? I think these are my favorite. The overalls. These color splash overalls really cute I'm like these just show how tall the doll is and then we have this awesome tiger shirt ah oh, this is so cute I love the options that they gave this one I'm not so crazy about this one See, it's just too bright that I can't even focus. But it's just like, I don't even like how it feels. But I'm not, I'm not crazy about this one. I think it's just the material that they chose. Um, I just, I like the two little lines on the side and I like that it's a long sleeve. But I just wish it wasn't this shiny fabric. Oh, and this is also awesome. This hoodie with a zipper. Does it open? <gasps> the zipper opens. Now oh, that's awesome. Well, how else was she supposed to put it on? But it comes with the hoodie. <sighs> Anybody who has a Cricut machine can literally like put whatever they want right here. See, that's how I think. I get distracted really easily because I'm already thinking about like if I was created enough to like modify some of these outfits already. I'm not crazy about this pattern or the color, but it is a very cute skirt. I guess it does match with the shoes. So. So now, I need to pick out an outfit. Whoa. So let's see what we can wear. How, how, how do I want her to dress? Ooh. Okay. Oh, no. I thought her body was stained, but it's just the fuzzies from the... From the clothes that she had previously. Um, 
Okay, we're gonna go with this shirt. Oh, I was gonna pick the overalls, but I kind of want to wear the pants, but then I wouldn't know what shoes to wear. So we're gonna go with the overalls. I still haven't decided whether I want to put the big hair or not. I feel like this short hair is more like, you know, casual and then like this fluffy, lovely, curly hair is more like for her, you know, fancier outings. Ooh, I do notice this little wrinkling right here. That usually happens because it's synthetic hair and it and that happens when it and it when it gets heat so i'm like was it in the sun for too long in the package i don't know or wherever it was previous to this but i don't like that so growing up i loved dolls like i mentioned but i would spend more hours decorating their home and styling them so that was more fun for me than the actual play time um, I just love doing their homes. I used to make their homes with whatever I found around the house. Um, I did have like furniture and stuff from like the Swami and like hand-me-downs from my sisters when they were younger. But yeah, that was more fun for me, the decorating than the actual play time and the styling. So I, I placed a shirt on the overalls. It's, um, it's not my favorite now looking at it, but I guess I could always see if I have another shirt that I could put on her and then um, go from there, but we'll see. I feel like she's staring into my soul. Look at, uh, let me get closer. Look at those beautiful details in the face, like the eyes and I love it. It's super, look, her little nose. And the lips, that's just really cute. I love that. Wow, okay. Very, I feel like she's more detailed than most of my dolls here. I'm gonna have to, I haven't really looked at them like that. I'm gonna put her in the pink sneakers. That's another thing there. She's very movable. Not, wait, yes on the knees? I didn't even notice. Yes, on the knees. So she's flexible on the knees, the ankles, the elbows, the wrist. So she has a lot of movement, which makes it fun because you could like pose them for pictures and stuff. Let me see. Oh, one thing that I noticed um, while seeing other people review these dolls and seeing them on their social accounts is that they could stand on their own two feet. The overalls are a little stiff. But I don't know how to fix that. Better for me, I guess. You don't have to look at me. But that's the end result. Let's see how it looks with the wig. How would I even put this on? Okay, so wait. Let me show you guys. So, there's no clips or anything on the actual... But I, I'm guessing it is supposed to snap on this little curve area for the ears. This reminds me of the color reveal Barbies that I have done on TikTok. Um, same concept here. And I don't like how those look on them. But I'm hoping this looks better. Because the way that they make it look on the packaging. So you have to match the curve of the ears. On both sides. How am I? I'm just gonna use her. Oh, okay. So I just. <laughs> this is why we're reviewing. So I just squeezed it on there with her hair that she has already on her head. And I guess. Oh, that looks so much better. Yes. Okay. So. Okay. there we go okay so this is how she looks with her other choice of hair obviously you have to fix it because it's all over the place I wish it was more spread out okay because I wanted to look like the picture okay we're just gonna and then this is the last it's her outfit let me know in the comments down below what would you have put on her 
and if you like the longer piece or the shorter piece which now I'm going to take it off even though it took me forever to put on do you prefer the headpiece or the short hair I prefer the headpiece but I'm also not a hater of this cute little haircut right here look at this what I'm not looking at myself yes I was okay okay you guys thank you for coming to this channel to review the creatable world let me show you guys again the picture the name creatable world a hundred different characters with one doll I do have another one let me see if they have options right here so I also have the one on the very top this doll right here I got her because of her red boots those are just so cute I have a lot of dolls I'll show a collection of them and I will be unboxing more dolls in the future as well so I guess there will be mini series in this channel so with that said yes more to come thank you and don't forget to like this video leave a comment down below um telling me what outfits you would have choose or what doll you have and anything else that i missed on this certain doll um leave any comments that you want and I'll read them. I'll, I, I'll, I read all of them because so far I haven't gotten a lot. But just know that I do look at them. And thank you for coming to my channel. Subscribe. Bye.